Tennis players must perfect their footwork, which is an important part of the practice routine. It entails a series of drills designed to improve players' speed and efficiency on the tennis court, so they can react fast to the ball and strike it with accuracy and forcefully. Since each player has a unique advance, skills and shortcomings, footwork instruction is tailored to them specifically. So one of the reasons that footwork training is more critical for Jan Leonard Straff, it is his body type. Here he is a tall player standing at 6 3 inch and has a larger frame than most of the other tennis players. This means that he needs to work hard to move around the tennis court and get into position to hit the ball. By focusing on footwork exercise, he can improve his agility and quickness, allowing him to move more efficiently around the tennis court. Another, another important reason that footwork training is more important for staff is his playing style. He is an aggressive uh, player who likes to hit the ball hard and take control of the tennis match. To do this effectively, he needs to be in the right position to hit the ball with maximum power and accuracy. By incorporating footwork exercise into his training, he can develop the footwork speed and coordination needed to get into position quickly and hit the ball with precision. Furthermore, strap footwork training is also unique because the specific exercise he incorporates into his, his, into his routine. He works in a, on a variety of drills such as ladder drills, cone drills and agility drills, which are designed to improve his quickness, power, balance and coordination. These exercises help him to develop skills needed to move around the tennis court more effectively, allowing him to get the ball easier and hit with more power and accuracy. In addition to his footwork track drills, Straff also focuses on prometric exercises to enhance his explosiveness and power. These exercises involve jumping, hopping, and bouncing, which help to develop the fast twitch muscle fibers needed to explosive movement on the tennis court. This type of training is especially important for Straff, as he has a powerful serve likes, and likes to take control of points with aggressive baseline play. If you have watched his last matches, his forehand lacked the power, spin, and precision that is required to compete at the highest level. This is something that he needs to address if he wants to take his game to the next level. So to develop his forehand, Straff needs to focus on a few key areas. The, the first is power. He needs to work on generating more, more pace on his forehand so that he can hit winners more consistently. This can be achieved by improving his technique and adding more strength to his shots. Uh, the second area is that, that Straff need is to work on his spin. A good top spin forehand is an, an essential weapon for any player and Straff needs to develop his shot if he wants to be a competitive against the other top players. This can be achieved by practicing the shot and focusing on a right grip and swing path. Finally, Straff needs to work on precision. He needs to be able to hit his forehand accurately and consistently, particularly when under pressure. This can be achieved by practicing his footwork, timing, and court positioning. His strength training routine is an important part of his overall training program that helps him to generate speed, power, and endurance. Strength training is a cr crucial for tennis players as it helps them to develop muscles necessary for explosive movements like serving, hitting forehands and backhand, and moving quickly on the court. In addition, strength training helps to reduce the risk of injury and by strengthening the muscles around the joints. Jan Leonard Straff strength, strength training programs includes his, uh, a variety of exercises that target different muscle groups. He focuses on a compound exercise that mark multiple muscle group at the same time, which is more important and efficient and effective than isolated exercise. One of the key exercises that strength training routine is the deadlift, 
this exercise targets the muscles on the leg, back and core, which are important for generating power in Teddy Strong. Trough performed the deadlift swing, heavy weights, which helps him to build strength and power. Another key important exercise is the trough routines in the bench presses. This is to target the chest, shoulder and triceps, which are more important for generating power in the serve. Staff performs the bench press using heavy weights, which helps him develop the upper body strength necessary for powerful staff. In addition to this compound exercise, staff also include exercises that target specific muscles groups such as biceps and triceps, pull ups. This exercise helps him to develop an arm strength necessary for hitting powerful forehand and backhand. Staff also includes exercises uh, uh, that focuses on developing uh, explosive power such as prometric and olympic lifts this type of exercise help him generate explosive power in his movement on the tennis court which is more important for hitting powerful shots and moving quickly around the tennis court in addition to his strength routine training routine staff also focuses on developing his aerobic system through a high intensity interval. This type of training involves short burst of uh, intense exercise followed by periods of rest, which helps develop the energy sy system necessary for high intensity activity like tennis matches. Staff also works on his flexibility and mobility through stretching and mobility exercise like yoga. This helps him maintain a good range of motion in his joints and prevent further injury, tennis injuries. The serve drill. Because it's an, a cornerstone of his game, Staff must excel at serving. His aggressive style of play, which entails gaining control of the point with the potent ground stock, is built up by a solid serve, which not only enables him to get a free points, but also allows him to do so. Additionally, tough opponents are placed under pressure by his reliable and precise serve, which makes him uh, them play defensively and open up to opportunities for Straff to attack. So to improve his serve, Straff needs to focus on several key areas. But first, he needs to work on his toss, ensuring that it is constant and in the correct position. This helps him to hit the ball at the right contact point and generate more power and accuracy. Staff also needs to improve his footwork and technique, using his legs to, and core to generate more power and control in his surf. Overall, improving his surf is critical for Straff to achieve his goals on the ATP Tour. By perfecting his surf, he can increase his chances of winning more matches competing at the highest level and, put, and potential winning Grand Slam in the near future. Straff primarily uses a two backhand, which is a common choice among professional players and has shown flashes of brilliance with the shot, but inconsistency has plunged him at times. Straff must refine his backhand if he wants to advance in his game. A powerful backhand enables a player to play more adaptable on the tennis court and can stop rival from taking advantage of vulnerabilities. Additionally, it offers a useful offensive tool that may, may be utilized to pro produce winners and exert professional pressure on his, on his rivals. Straff's backhand flutter under pressure and that it in a fourth error or a shaky return that it can be harmful to his game. So one another, one other major benefit of using a two backhand is our increased power and control. It provides with both hands on the racket. A player can generate more force and spin on this shot, allowing them to hit the ball harder and with more accuracy. Additionally, the use of two hand can provide better stability and balance allowing players to, to make more consistent and controlled shoots.